the crop I work on is common beans, commonly called as beans, beans, beans in East Africa. It's a food security crop and it is mostly grown by women because, you know, women are in charge of food security in our societies. Farms, they are not these big farms you can imagine with, you know. So I grew up in the village that is really away from city life. I come from a family of very many girls. My dad had more than three quarters of the children were girls. So when he sent us to school, people were wondering, why? Why are you sending girls to school? You are wasting your time. They are going to get married. But good enough, he was educated. He was a civil engineer. So he knew the value of education. He insisted and educated all his girls who wanted to go to school. As a, as a girl in primary school, they always said, it's boys who do sciences, you know? We are supposed to do the easier subjects like English, social studies, not mathematics and science. So from there already, a girl child is biased. At a very early stage, ah, mathematics is hard. And yet that is the basis for doing science at a higher level. The work I'm doing under my PAL program on bean root rots, that is, the, we have a host of pathogens that cause wilting of young beans at about four weeks. So it is a serious disease that causes yield losses of between 70 to even sometimes 100%. In the past, it was not a big problem. But when we did our surveys under this project, we realized that it is all over the country. And uh, we found places where it was reducing the stand, the common bean stand. You know, crop stand has a significant effect on final yield. So there's a lot of yield loss. Because once it gets the plant, the plant has no chance of surviving. So if we find a resistant line, which we are almost there. We have already done some crosses in the screen house and they are being tested now. And then we have a plan of using this resistance to improve market class varieties. So if we produce a resistant variety, obviously that will change the lifestyle of the farmers a lot.